Hey everyone, it's Anna. Thanks so much for visiting my channel. Yesterday I shared a card that I received from Jill Norwood and it had in it um, a stamped image that she sent to me and it was a little angel with jingle bells as her feet and I wanted to share that I made a card with her. Um, first I used the paper pad uh, Woodland Forest. I just used a couple different sheets from this pad. I also used some gold foiled cardstock, some brown cardstock and white cardstock. And here's my card. Didn't she turn out so cute? I love her little face and her cute little prim wings. So I think she turned out really, really darling. I did use some of my tea dyed seam binding and an old vintage button on here as well. And a couple of uh, dies from uh, Spellbinders. So I think she turned out really cute. And so Jill, thank you so much for sharing her with me. Uh, here's the info that Jill sent to me about her. Uh, the uh, image number is NN850 from QKR Stampede, and the website Quad K didn't work for me, but I found it on um, stamponit.com or stampiton.com. I can't remember which one it was. So it's either stamp on it or stamp it on. <laughs> I can't remember which one it was, uh, but this Quad K didn't work for me. But uh, she was definitely on the site uh, under that image number. So isn't she cute? I think she's adorable. I love her little face. So thank you, Jill, so much for sending her to me. On the inside, I just added a white piece of paper, another piece of this uh, paper here from the paper pad. There's that gold uh, foil paper that I used. It's really pretty as well. And on the back, I uh, just let that foil wrap around and then I stamped uh, one of my little designed and stamped by stamps that I have. And then the little pencil cup and stamp image. So that's that card. And then also yesterday I shared that I got this stamp in the mail that I purchased on eBay. This is a Diana Markham stamp before she was doing stamps for Stamp Passions. And uh, so I made a card with them last night. I thought I would share it as well. Isn't that cute? <clears throat> so they are stamped on uh, Nina linen paper and colored with uh, alcohol markers. I used a little piece of red velvet here to kind of match the uh, red heart that she's holding and her little flower and the birds. And then I used one of these little wooden hearts that I picked up at the Dollar Tree for Valentine's Day. They were like these little wood pieces um, in red and pink and um, natural. So. I think this turned out really cute. The card base itself is actually a uh, plaid note card that I picked up at Hobby Lobby. Uh, there was a box of them, so that's what the back looks like. And then on the inside, I just stamped, sometimes good things happen to people, like when you happen to me. This is from an old Stampin' Up! set. I'm not sure which one, but I love that sentiment. So um, the uh, card came from this set of note cards. And this I picked up at Hobby Lobby. Um, I actually ordered it online at, around Christmas time when I was trying to find some of that faux snow for the little train houses and stuff. I added this to my order so that I could get shipping. <laughs> so, but anyways, those are my two cards to share with you today for hashtag snowman of January. There's still time to submit ideas for the hashtag for February um, so that I get um, lots of feedback and consider everybody's um, ideas. So let me know if you have any preferences for the feedback, uh, the uh, hashtag for February, and I'll do that video soon. Take care, everyone. Bye.